Hello YouTube and uh, welcome back to another video. It's been ages since my uh, my last vid. Um, haven't done a video in about four weeks now. Um, reason being, probably just I've just been doing a lot of other stuff. The weather's been good, so just spending a lot of time outdoors. Um, when I haven't been working, just sort of hanging out with my friends really, just sort of um, living life a bit more. Um, you know, I mean, I have been uh, picking up games. I've bought a few games. Obviously, as I'm going to show you, is this, this is a pickup video. But um, I've just really been spending a lot more time outdoors, living life a bit more. Um, I've sort of um, been trying to um, make more of an effort to sort of hang out with my friends a bit more. Um, there was, there was, there's been a period of time where. I, I rarely ever get to see them. I don't spend a lot of time with them. And uh, the reason for that is because um, I tend to work a lot of weekends. So I don't really get much of a chance to spend time with my friends. So that's really what I've been doing. Um, I had a friend of mine who uh, he recently came back for a visit from Australia. A very good friend of mine. He's been living in Australia now for the last, um, last four years. And uh, he came back to the UK to sort of celebrate his... Um, his uh, his thirtieth birthday, so um, you know I, I sort of went down to see him, and uh, there's just been a lot of sort of um, lot of parties and a lot of sort of events that have been happening here and there that I've sort of really been sort of going out my way to 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 sort of go to, and um, you know I mean plus the fact I mean I just haven't really been in much of a mood to make videos. I mean as most as you all as most people know, you know, it's a hobby, so you know you should only really be doing them when when you know you feel like doing them. And uh, lately, I just haven't been in the mood to to make any videos. Um, as some of you know, I have been watching, commenting when I get the chance. Um, there have been quite a lot of videos that I've watched that I haven't commented on, and that's just because most of the times when I'm watching people's stuff, I'm sort of watching it while I'm getting ready to do something or I'm going out or something, and and most of the times I'm watching videos on my phone, so it's not like I don't really get a chance to sort of sit there and respond. I just sort of like click on the like button and, and just sort of move on to the next video if I can. Otherwise, I'm sort of like rushing around and watching or just sort of have it playing in the background uh, while I'm doing other stuff. Um, but, you know, that I, that obviously I do get time to, to sit down properly and just sort of watch, watch other people's videos. So, you know... Um, I have been active as a viewer, but just not been uh, making uh, that much uh, videos. Um, but there, there are going to be um, a, a couple of videos coming out uh, shortly. Um, I mean, this is a pickups video, and uh, I will have another pickups video because I actually have quite a lot of stuff here. So I'm actually going to split it off into two videos. Um, uh, one will just because essentially. I've got sort of a, a whole bunch of um, Wii games that I've been picking up, uh, as well as a trade that I did with another YouTuber. Um, but I'm going to, I think I'm going to hold off on that video. Uh, I'm going to make it, I'll probably make it now actually. So so if you, when you watch that video, you'll you'll see me wearing the same thing. Because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to film it straight after this, but I'm probably going to upload it um, a few days later or, or the following week maybe. Um, and I've got a couple of other videos that I need to make as well, so um, I'll, you know, you're going to see a, a, a little bunch of videos coming out within the next couple of weeks from me. Um, but yeah, enough waffling. Um, yeah, I've got a few pickups here. This is actually stuff that I picked up a while ago now, um, probably about a month and a half ago. Uh, not a lot of stuff. Um, uh, most of my main focus has been on sort of picking up sort of gems for the Wii, but the stuff that I'm going to show you in this video are, are not Wii games. They're just um, just other games that uh, I, I I'm glad that I've really picked some great stuff here actually. Um, just really glad that I picked it up. Um, so I just you know I had to put this video out just to I didn't want to leave it too long. But um, yeah, I've got a nice selection here. Uh, got a few. Uh, PlayStation 1 games, uh, GBA games, uh, 3DS, and a PS3 game as well. So I thought we'd just get started now. 
Uh, first game I picked up, and um, actually no, we'll start with one game that uh, I actually neglected to mention um, in my last video. I, my last pickup video I did, uh, if you recall, I, I showed a bunch of uh, boxed and complete uh, Game Boy Advance games. And I actually missed one out, a really good one as well, and I just completely forgot to include it. So uh, this is the one that uh, I just forgot to include in my last video. Really great game. Uh, glad to finally get it boxed and complete. And uh, that is um, Advance Wars. Uh, fantastic game for the Game Boy Advance. It really is. Very, very addictive. Um, it's a uh, tactical RPG. Uh, a lot of fun. Uh, discovered this game uh, playing it on emulation on my smartphone. And really did enjoy it, so uh, I ended up having a loose cart of it for a while. Uh, but I then decided to go after a, a box and complete uh, copy. Um, it is in a sentinel case. Um, should I take it out? Just to show you, it's a really good nick actually. Um, yes, yeah, so as you can see, uh, it's in really, really good nick. Bought it on eBay, um, wasn't expensive, it was, um, I believe it was about 11 quid all in, so it was yeah, very good, very, very glad to, to get this into the collection. Uh, fantastic, one of the best games on the Game Boy Advance, no doubt. Okay. Okay, so uh, next uh, Game Boy Advance game I picked up, and this is just a loose cart. Um, I did try and seek out a box and complete copy of this game, but it's just going for a bit too much, the, uh, more than I'm willing to pay for it. Um, this loose cart was actually, I probably overpaid for this loose cart, but um, you know, it, it's not one that I see around much, let alone in the wild. Um, I found out about this game through um, through Lee, um, aka Nez Nutter, uh, Cube Meister General slash. Uh, Retro Fusion now, and uh, he was the one that sort of brought this game to my attention in one of his videos. Looks really, really interesting. I actually would have, had I not seen gameplay footage of this that he put up, I would have definitely have passed this game by. And uh, that is um, uh, Medal of Honor Infiltration, and uh, it's actually a, uh, a top-down uh, running gun game, very similar to uh, games like uh, Mercs. And uh, it's a fantastic game, really is. Uh, really great um, top-down run-and-gun shooter. Um, yeah, really great fun, actually. And uh, it was about... I paid about a fiver for this all-in, so I think I overpaid for it, but uh, whatever. Glad to get it, though. Great game. And uh, next game here is for the uh, PS3. And... Um, Basically a game that's been on my radar. I, I picked up the HD collection of this series uh, just to sort of get me going. I always did plan on picking up this game. It was being sold on Amazon brand new for a tenner, so I thought I'd pick it up. And that is uh, uh, Splinter Cell Blacklist. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about this game, actually. Um, people people say it's a really good stealth game. Um, so I yeah, definitely look forward to, to playing this one at some point. So yeah, glad to get that. Next game I have here, this is for the 3DS. And uh, this has actually been, probably was my most highly anticipated 3DS game this year. Uh, ever since it was announced, um, I, I just sort of had it on pre-order. Definitely had to get this game. Uh, and it's fantastic. Really lives up to... To, to what, what what I was expecting. And uh, the game is uh, Kirby Triple Deluxe. Brilliant, brilliant game. Um, I, have to, I have to say, like I really do enjoy the Kirby games. And I think the reason why I enjoy them so much is because they just, they're just so much fun. They just, they do just bring me back to that, that old time when I was, when I was a kid playing Super Mario Brothers. It's just, it's just a lot of fun. I mean, the Kirby games aren't the most challenging games in the world. But they're just so much fun to play. And um, yeah, this definitely this definitely lives up. Fantastic game. Um, it's actually three games in one. It's um, the, You've got the regular sort of standard platform Kirby game. Uh, and then you've also got like a sort of Smash Brothers 
uh, a game called Kirby Fighters, and uh, it also comes with, um, I believe, like a, like a challenge, uh, like a like a sort of mini game uh, section as well, and uh, it's brilliant, fantastic. This is this is a high recommendation for the 3DS. If you're picking up for the 3DS, you must get this game. It is absolutely brilliant. Uh, so much fun to play. Really, really happy with it. Um, yeah, just really, really glad to get this one finally. And uh, lastly, I've uh, picked up uh, four uh, PlayStation 1 games here. These are all gems. Um, I actually picked up all four of these from the same seller on eBay. Um, the guy was actually selling these games, surprisingly, for very good prices. Below the going rate of the buy it nows. And uh, they were all in fantastic condition. I couldn't believe my luck. He had a whole slew of games, PlayStation 1 games, um, that I wanted. Uh, but obviously I had to limit myself. But I, had to, I bought these four uh, because they were very much on my list to get. Uh, I kind of regret there was one game that I wanted to get from him that, that I probably should have bought as well. But you, know, you can't buy them all. Um, I, I tried to actually go back and get it, but someone else had bought it. It was uh, Jumping Flash 2. Uh, I really wanted to get that game. Um, but I'm glad with what I managed to get. Uh, picked up some great games here. Uh, they're all shooters. Uh, just ones that I definitely needed for the collection. And uh, the first game I picked up. Uh, and, this, and this is actually one that's uh, quite, quite tricky to find. Can go for a lot of money. Um, but I got it for a good price. And that was um, Elite Squad. And uh, what this is, this is the sequel to uh, CT Special Forces. And uh, even though the case says Elite Squad, the game itself is actually called CT Forces 2 uh, Back to Hell. That's what it says in the in-game in the in-game text. Uh, it's essentially it's a it's a 2D side scrolling run and gun shooter. Um, I've got the first game on the Game Boy Advance. It's a lot of fun. It's a great so it plays it kind of looks a lot like Metal Slug in, in many ways, but it's not quite as fast paced as the Metal Slug series. It's definitely a lot more slower paced, but it is a, a 2D uh, run and gun action game. This one can actually be quite pricey to get. Uh, picked it up for a tenner, which I thought was was a good was a good price, and it's in fantastic condition. Manual discs, not a mark on them, so really really tough to get this one. And oops, let's drop in. And the uh, next game I have here, this is one that I, I've sort of been checking out footage on. Um, Minx Minx eighty six uh, recently did a video of this. He had it, he he recently picked up the game. I believe it was for the uh, the the uh, Turbo Graphics Duo, and um, just coincidental. I happened to pick it up around the same time. It's a fantastic game. One that I'd actually never played before. I I, I did know of it, but uh, I was checking out footage of it. Soundtrack is amazing to this game. It really is. It's a brilliant shooter. So hard though, but uh, I'm very glad to, to to get it finally in the collection. And uh, that is um, Viewpoint. And uh, this is quite an interesting shooter because it's actually not. It's not a horizontal shooter, and it's not a top-down shooter. Actually, it's kind of isometric. And uh, it's a lot of fun. Very, very good game. Uh, but really hard though. I am so shit at this game. Um, I can't even beat the first level. Uh, so I, I definitely need to, to sort of practice. But uh, it's so much fun. It really is a great game. And uh, like the other one, it's in fantastic condition. There's not a mark on the disc. I really lucked out with this seller actually. Um, um, he was selling these games at very good prices. Uh, just, just way below the usual, the average sort of eBay price. And um, and uh, yeah, so and they're in fantastic condition. They were well packaged as well. So yeah, really really chuffed to get this one as well. And uh, the next one I've got here, um, uh, this is from a, a series that I am very familiar with. I, I do have a couple of games from this series already on, on other formats. Uh, I've never played this particular game though, and uh, it's a fantastic game. Great um, horizontal shoot 'em up. And that is um, G Darius, a uh, really fun game. And again, it's in fantastic condition. Uh, yeah, so much fun with this game, brilliant game. Um, highly recommend this one actually, it's a lot of fun. Probably 
the one I've, I've been playing the most besides Viewpoint. I've really been trying at Viewpoint, but it's, it's really, really hard. Uh, this one, I seem to get a little bit further on, but not, not that much, but it's a great game. Uh, definitely, definitely uh, recommend it. And uh, lastly, here's another shoot 'em up. This is one that has been on my list for a long time. I've heard of a lot of good people, uh, sorry, a lot of good people, a lot of people uh, tell me this is a really good game. Um, but unfortunately, it's one of those games that goes for a lot of money. Uh, I generally see it on eBay for about 40 quid, uh, which is, I wasn't prepared to pay that much for it. Uh, but I saw this game, it was being sold for £18 by the same seller, and, and, and it is fantastic condition. I'd, I'd say it's mint as well. It's, it's, not a mark on the disc, it's it's, it's fantastic condition. Uh, really tough to get this because it's actually quite a tricky one to get hold of. And uh, that is um, Ray Crisis. Uh, yeah, really, really tough to get this one. This is actually one of those games, again, it's really, really hard. It's a, uh, top, it's a, a vertical shooter. Quite hard though, I have to admit. Very, very tricky game. Um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. Um, I'm probably not enjoying this one as much as uh, as Viewpoint or G Darius, but it's definitely a really cool game. And for 18 quid, and it's like it's in like practically mint mint condition, not a mark on the box, nothing at all. Uh, yeah, really, really chuffed to get this one uh, finally off the list. So yeah, very, very happy to get that as well. So that's it, guys. That is actually uh, my pickups that I've, I've bought. I bought the, those um, about to say a month and a half ago, so nearly two months now. Um, so really, really happy with those games. I've been spending a lot of time playing um, that Medal of Honor inf infiltration games. A lot of fun. Great top-down shooter. Um, Ray Crisis. Great game. Um, really trying to get into Viewpoint, but it's, it's just really it's kicking my ass, that game. It's a lot of fun, though. Uh, the music is great, really enjoying that game. And uh, G Darius is a brilliant game. I mean, I kind of knew what to expect with G Darius. I'm quite familiar with the series. Uh, it's a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, really have been enjoying that one. So that's it, guys. I will be back with a, another pickups video shortly. It will be all Wii titles. Uh, and that also includes a trade, a trade that I did with an awesome YouTuber. So stay tuned for that one. Um, thanks very much for watching, guys. I will be back very soon. If you like the video please give it a thumbs up it's always appreciated appreciated and of course guys leave your comments below let me know what you think of these games i know some of you are big shoot em up fans so let me know what you guys think of these games i'd love to hear your thoughts as well and um yeah i will be back very soon guys i won't leave it so long next time so thanks for watching and uh yeah take care bye bye